They, they don't have penetrating sight, basira. It's the same whether you warn them or you don't warn them. They don't believe. Now the problem, and this is important for Muslims, one of the problems with modern Muslims is they assume everybody's kafir if they're not Muslim. These verses aren't talking to everybody who's not a Muslim. They're talking about people who are arrogant, puffed up, filled with pride, and wouldn't give you the time of day. Read the, uh, the descriptions of the kuffar in the Quran. They're jawal, they're mutakabbir, yistakbirun, they're muhtalun fakhur, they're zalimun. I mean, these are the attributes that Allah gives them. Most people are nas. A lot of them are just in ghafla. They're just nas. That's why Allah first calls people Ya yuhal nas before He calls them Ya yuhal kafirun or Ya yuhal ladina kafaru. He calls them Ya yuhal nas. Because initially He didn't call the Arabs Ya yuhal kafirun because they weren't kafirun. But after seeing miracles, after witnessing everything that they had witnessed, and treating the Prophet ﷺ the way they treated for doing nothing other than calling them to their own success. Allah said, Haq al-Qawl. No, this is, it's, this is too much. You can't get away with this. So it's important, you know, that people should not apply these things to people that they see out there walking around. The majority of these people, even though they have a legal status, which is outside of Islam, you don't assume about people that, I mean, I'll give you an example. And this, this is, it's, you know, it's just an example from my own experience. You know, I, I made a statement right after 9-11 where I said, if it was in an interview with a newspaper, that if there were any martyrs in that event, it would have been the firefighters. And, and somebody went to my teacher in Saudi Arabia my teacher, Sheikh Abdul bin Bayah, and said that I said that the, the kuffar were shuhada. Now, it's a very interesting. I mean, first of all, Sheikh Abdullah said, what word did he use? Did he say shaheed? He said, no, he said martyr. He said, well, look it up in the dictionary. And because he, he knows French, he said martyr. He said, it's true, they're martyrs. Because in French, a martyr is the one that gives his life for other people. <laughs> that, that's called manduha, you know. I mean, the, you know. The, the thing about Muslims is they're supposed to actually look for excuses for people. <laughs> so he was just being a good Muslim. <laughs> but anyway, my point is that the assumption was they were kuffar. Did you check those firemen? Did you go and ask them what they believed and how? The, the basis is not kuffar, it's iman. People are believers before they're disbelievers. The assumption about people is belief before it's disbelief. Because belief is a fitra state. Isn't our deen, deen al-fitra? Don't we believe that people are actually by fitra inclined to believe in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? So their inherent state is belief. And disbelief is actually a state that comes later. Because of arrogance for whatever reasons. But these are problems. Too severe making things too... To, it's just simple kuffar, Muslim. This makes everything easy. You know, just Red Sea, split it. We're on that side, they're on that side. Well, not me. You know, I'm a convert. <laughs> okay, so I know what it's like on both sides. Because I've been on both sides. And, and by the way, kuntum khaira ummatin ukhrijat linnas, you were the best people, past tense. No, seriously, that's the tafsir. Read it for yourselves. Muslims talk about kuntum khair, and they think like it's present tense. We're the best people. No, you, what, what, what are you doing for humanity right now? Where, where's your great medical discoveries? You know, where's, where's your aid to starving countries? What are you doing for Darfur? What are you, you know, I mean, seriously, what? Just tu'minuna billahi, right? 
And then what? تَأْمُرُونَ بِالْمَعْرُوهُ وَتَنْهَوْنَ عَنِ الْمُنْكَارِ It's not just iman billah. You have to be actually out there doing things to get the khayriya in this ummah. But that's a past tense. Kuntum khayra ummatin ukhrijat linnas. That group were all converts. For people that, uh, you, you know, your daughter's too good to marry to the convert because, you know, you're, uh, you've got your tree that goes back 12 generations. And he doesn't even know who his great-grandfather was. Just something to think about.